was shot in the back of class. I have had red, make love, no more. You reach a certain level of acclaim where you're going to inherit a little bit of notoriety. Even if you're Mother Teresa, if a million people know your name, you're always going to have 50,000, 75,000, 100,000 who manage to scramble around and find some kind of bone to pick with you. <sighs> Mr. Beast. And here's the baby. Deaf social media users are criticizing Mr. Beast after he helped 1,000 deaf people here for the first time, arguing that his stunt is ableist. I never understood that word ableist. Shouldn't it be disableist? Because he's, because it's discriminatory against people who are disabled, not able. Mr. Beast unveiled his latest video, tweeting, We helped 1,000 deaf people here again. Go watch. Good. We help, you know, it's not it's not eugenics. He's not storming in and and sort of like Joseph Mengel forcing these people under to go under the, the needle. It's uh it's voluntary, it's willing participants. In the six minute clip, Donaldson introduced us to several of the people they helped here again after getting their hands on three million dollars of cutting edge technology. How, how can you how can you whine about that? I don't understand. You know, yes, he's monetizing it. He's doing a good deed and monetizing it. Oh, you should just do it anyway. Really? But what about the people who are posting content, monetizing it, and not helping people in the content and the in the in the videos? Like they're just posting because they like posting. I do agree. You should encourage everyone to to help others. Um off camera but why can't you help them on camera as well why is there an issue with that it's so, it's so bizarre it's such bizarre it's such a bizarre logic we, we are not living in intellectual times let's look at some of the tweets that came out following this this diabolical act of Mr Beast helping people who wanted to hear hear again so let's see. Um, all right. I'll watch when you start paying people's houses off. I'll watch when you start helping with the homeless more. I'll start watching when you actually use your influence for the right thing. Well, if you've got that mindset, you can say that about anything. And what about, well, well is, 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 that, is that homeless? Ist? To go out and help homeless people. Implying that those who live on the streets are are, are down and out and, and inferior. You know. Maybe he will do that in the future. Maybe he has he, he probably has done something similar to that. At some point. Quotes, we helped people here for views. Okay, that's better than, you know, uh, a talk gossiping about celebrities for views or it's better than the, the it's just a prank bro types who go out and just cause mayhem in supermarkets for views it's better than using your children you know videoing your children doing silly things for views or you know we help people here for views like what else okay what's the alternative we antagonize people for views would you prefer that south sank three six five eight four nine eight four eight nine one it's just it's just some people just can't, can never be pleased, you know. What else have we got in here? He's cancelled. Oh, Reekin, Reekin was stolen. He's cancelled. Okay, let's take a look at his social blade and see how cancelled he is. Up 33% subscribers. 7 million in the past 30 days. 1.3 billion views in the past 30 days. Up 17.5%. 
the subs since 26th of March have just steadily been increasing million by million. So he's not cancelled. You don't have any power. If you're watching the videos, then you're you're contributing. He gets paid for views, not for likes. Elon Musk defends Mr. Beast against criticism from deaf people. Despite receiving significant criticism over a video in which he helped treat 1,000 people's blindness, popular video, popular YouTuber Mr. Beast doubled down on making videos about helping disabled people in which he helped a thousand people, deaf people here for the first time. Why would you not want to hear? Like, why would you not want to be able to listen to music? Why would you not want to be able to hear your, your significant other say I love you? You know, it's just pathetic. Do you ever worry about your mental health? There's so many great things to hear. The crashing of waves. Other things. There's other things as well. It's just foolish.